Folks, the multiverse is closed. Beta is still ongoing. So we are here running through a new character that I wanted to show you guys, and that is Finn the Human. So Finn the Human is a very unique character in this game. He has a unique mechanic that I've never really seen anything like this in a fighting game before, and that is his gold. So he's the only character in the game that has gold. When you hit the enemy, gold comes out. Then you got to run around and collect it all. And then what do you do with this gold? You actually go shopping. Is this not insane? You can go shopping in the middle of the match, think it over, decide what to buy. Uh, we can buy boots of speed. That's going to increase our uh, max movement speed. Uh, let's get some more real quick. We're up to 700, so now we can buy the butt armor. This is going to give you armor on pretty much all of your attacks that you can charge. And the really nice thing is this applies to your teammates as well. So uh, he's providing a lot of team utility since this game is completely designed around 2v2. Uh, Finn is primarily like a damage dealer, but uh, he does have a little bit of utility that he offers to the team. So that can be handy as well. All right, now we're, we're above 1,000 gold. So now we can buy the ultimate trump card here, BMO. BMO is so cute. I, I just love BMO, but he can also be deadly. So let, let's rack up some damage on the opponent here, see what we can do. So generally, I think in most matches, you are going to want to follow the tech tree. You know, get get one level of boots, get one level of armor, and then get BMO. You can buy multiple levels of boots, but they all go away when you die. And you can see that the BMO chop does absolutely massive damage. So I think that that's going to be a better use of your gold in most circumstances versus just stacking boots. They also get more expensive every time you buy one. So it can be hard to get a bunch of boots, but you can go really fast once you do. So yeah, I was really impressed by the design of this character. I thought it was cool that in this game, you know, they didn't really take the easy way out and just make him, you know, a, a, a dude who hits you with the sword. They gave him this extra aspect that makes him very cool and unique. He also has a couple other cool things. He can throw this gem that he can teleport to. That costs a little bit of gold as well. It costs 100. And then you can see he also has this little high five meter uh, below him. So he can charge up high fives and smack the enemy with it. Or you can smack your teammates, which creates like a clap and is going to send the opponents flying. So uh, a cool little character who I think might be potentially top tier. A lot of people are saying this. He's got crazy sword normals. He's got good combos. And uh, he's got BMO. So what else is there? <laughs> what else could you possibly need? Look at BMO killing, dude. The damage and knockback on that is way too good. So what do you guys say? We hop online. Let me know if you think this is a cool mechanic. Are there any other characters who you would like to see me explore in a video? I would love to do it for you guys. Uh, but until then, let's hop online, see if we can get some dubs here with Finn the Human. Should be fun. Stick around, guys. All right, looks like we're teamed up with Taz. Ooh, Taz can be so annoying with his spinner. Uh, really great character. So, uh, you know, I guess I'll just, I'll just copy him. I don't really know why he's doing projectile speed. Considering uh, neither of us are really projectile characters. Maybe let's do Lumpy Space Punch instead. Get some increased damage on melee attacks. And that sounds good to me. Alright, looks like the other team has a Finn as well. So, of course, our entire goal here is we just have to be number one Finn. If I can, be, if I can have more damage and kills than the other Finn, uh, I'm going to feel good about myself. But right now, we're kind of getting wrecked by the other Finn. So, let's fix that. There, that's better. So, uh, I didn't mention Finn's up B. That's the move where he spins his backpack around. So, that's probably his number one best killing move is his up B. Uh, it will kill at relatively low percent, especially if you're high up on the screen. Uh, but it does use up some of your gold. So, And that the more gold you have in your backpack, the heavier it'll be, which means that your up B is going to be stronger. So you have to be a little careful about it. It only uses the gold if it actually connects, which is nice. So you can feel free to whiff it all day. I'm just going around picking up gold here, trying to get to 1k. This Batman is really zoning me out from my teammate, unfortunately. I want to get in there and high five him. Alright, so we have 1k now. Oops. Did I just buy a second butt armor? 
There we go. Charged attacks, utilizing the armor on those. Nice. Good stuff, Taz. A smooth little double kill. What I would really like is to try to high five Taz, but I don't think that's gonna happen. We are we are way too high on damage getting knocked around, so we got a tiny bit of a head start on damaging these guys. Oh my gosh, off the top, is it possible? I've got the bat bomb on me, which is not ideal, but we managed to dodge the explosion. Let's see if we can get some gold going and get our tech tree back up here. Alright, other Finn got some boots of speed before we could stop him. Chasing the Finn down. Alright, boots of speed. Now we'll be a little faster. I'd like to get the armor as well because really having those armored charge attacks does make neutral a little bit more easy. You can just kind of spam charge attacks and be a little bit safer about it. Going for a high five. Okay, we got it, but we were a little out of range on the clap effect. Unfortunate. That would have been hype. All right, all right, all right. Uh, we don't have gold. Okay, now we have gold, butt armor. There, now we can spam charge attacks a little bit. Oh, trying to get the up B kill. Oh, okay, we got the kill on Batman, but we did get spiked by Finn at the same time. But Taz closed it out for us. Very nicely done. Lunar Elysium, the Taz. Well played. I think that's going to be two and two kills, though. I think this was a pretty even match between me and my teammate. Two and two. Let's go. And look at this. Okay, number one Finn. That's what we like to see. Barely. Barely. The other Finn did very well as well. And yeah, this is kind of the problem that I've seen with Batman. I do think that Batman has a lot of potential. Batman has very, very strong combos. Very strong neutral control with Batarang. But Batman really cannot kill. So I've seen this problem crop up a lot with Batman is that he ends up doing so much damage, but uh, his kill moves leave a little bit to be desired. He doesn't do that much knockback. So looks like the Batman player is switching to Shaggy, which is like the exact opposite. Shaggy kills so easily. Shaggy's uh, up B, his Shoryuken off the top is absolutely one of the best kill moves in the game. Unreal, and then uh, if he can power up and go Super Saiyan, uh, Shaggy gets a lot of extra properties on his moves that'll make him even easier to kill with. So we're gonna have to watch out for that for old Uncle Shagworth. Maybe we should make a Shaggy video. I, I haven't done it because uh, he's kind of like the character you use in the tutorial, and he's kind of like a pretty simple character. He's designed to be uh, one of the first characters that beginners start with in the game. So I didn't think a tutorial about him would be that interesting. But may maybe I should make a video just like this about Shaggy. Let me know what you think down in the comments. And of course, if you have a request for a character you'd like to see, let me know that as well. So we are barely avoiding the uh, armor kick there from Shaggy. There's so much gold here on the ground that I just wasted. Okay, the teammate can pick up the gold for you, so that that is a nice little touch. Let's buy boots of speed. Nice! We lost some gold on that, but I think it's worth it to get the huge damage. Taz dies first, unfortunately, but we're really low on, on damage here, so... We got boots of speed times two because I forgot I already bought them, but, you know, it's fine. It's fine to be fast. There we go. Get him off here. I should be careful being near the edge. I'm, I'm still low enough that I'm going to be pretty hard to kill, but one spike would be enough, probably. He's trying to go shopping on me? Alright, I need to buy the butt armor. Oh, Bebo Chomp double kill? Oh, no. That's bad. I am definitely not going to be number one Finn on this one, guys. Okay, okay. We got rid of him, though. He's trying for that up B kill. The Shoryuken. Do I have money to shop? I do. I do. Uh-oh. We're getting mauled here. We're going to need a double kill. 
to close it out. We're only at two points here. Just trying to protect my teammate, but it's too little too late. All right, it's going down to game three, guys. Ooh, we got a hype one on our hands. Let's see if we can close it out. I think the shaggy switch was exactly what that team needed. As you can see from the fact that he got three KOs. Guys, we were still number one Finn, though. We were still number one Finn by nine, nine points of damage. <laughs> Give me some credit here. All right, we got to win this one. Hopefully, you know, I think maybe that stage was just hard for us. I don't know. That's my. That's going to be my excuse, but let, let's, let's go back into it here. All right, this is for all the marbles, and we're on Finn's home stage, too. How appropriate. Oh, no, they switched to Jake the dog. All right, I need to I need to go for some big boy combos here. This stage is just such such a an all out brawl, dude. Oh, it's crazy. All right, we got to shop. Give me my space so I can shop. Okay, we got speed and armor. Oh, he's going he's going horse mode. Leave me alone, Jake! I'm going for some fanciness here. High five! Oh, we missed again! I think the high five is maybe a little bit easier to use if you're in a pre-made with a friend and you're like voice chatting and stuff. Oh, jeez. Uh, can I get a BMO? Alright, we got BMO. Nice kill, Taz. Oh, no, the chop missed! Did you guys see that? That was so cursed! Oh, God. I warped to the gem that was, like, off screen. Okay, draw game, draw game. There we go, nice combo. Uh, I need to buy butt armor. Uh, it's a little scary being this close to the top. All right, charged high five. Oh, I missed. No, 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 that's so bad dying at low percent there. I might have just sealed our fate. Okay. Okay. Not not enough gold in the backpack to do huge knockback, though. We have to protect Taz. He's so low. Yeah, Taz is just running. He's doing the right thing here. Leave him alone! Off top. Any chance? At this point, I'm not even shopping. I'm just kind of saving my gold for my backpack so I can try to kill off top with it. Okay, one more, one more. We just gotta take out Jake the dog. No! <laughs> Honestly, I think that was my fault, guys. The fact that I went off edge and then I got spiked. That really sealed the deal, because otherwise I was at such low percent. Uh, the other Finn got all the all the kills that time. You know, toast Taz. I'll just toast them all. Why not? Uh, I really wanted to dub on that, but I think you guys can see some of the cool stuff that Finn can do. And hopefully I got to show off some cool combos in that last game as well. Uh, up A, jump cancel, side A into side B into up B is something that you can do. I think I landed that like one time. Uh, and then his uppy has insane kill potential if you have a lot of gold in the backpack. So, uh, yeah, guys, I'm really, really loving the game. This is not a sponsored video. I'm purely playing the game because I'm having so much fun. I don't want to stop playing. It's going to be so sad when the beta ends. I think it's got a few more days left. Uh, and then it's going to be over and I'm, I'm going to cry, guys. What am I going to play? I don't know. Let me know before it ends what else you'd like to see down in the comments. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching. I highly appreciate it. Bye, everybody.